Good morning, it's uh, your boy Mikey Bustos bringing you another video. It's 9.19 a.m. Just woke up, um, been working already. Um, I just wanted to create this video because um, there's a lot of buzz now going on saying that tomorrow will be the end of the world. Now, I, for right away, right off the bat, I'm going to say I don't believe that. Um, not that I don't believe in the end of the world or any of that. Um, I just don't believe tomorrow will be. <laughs> for those who are religious, um, and for those who, you know, read the Bible and all of that, um, you know, it, in the Bible it does say that he will come like a thief in the night, you know, not on a day when everyone's bracing themselves, <laughs> because they know that, you know, Saturday will be the day of rapture or whatever, you know, where, you know, Apparently, allegedly Christians will be saved and you know they'll become balls of light and assume into heaven and everyone else on earth will just have to deal with a very dreary and like horrible fate <laughs> um, so yeah I don't believe that uh, also another thing too is to me an all-knowing and omniscient like infinitely intelligent like beyond anything we can conceive, God, you know, a mind, um, a mind that is so much more intelligent than us that like we're we're specks, you know what I mean? Like we're as intelligent as ants in comparison, you know. The this, the intelligence uh, difference is just in infinity. It's it's great. Okay, so imagine it being like that. He is not going to create and appoint the end of the world on a day that could be calculated by an equation that a human can work out. <laughs> so the man who worked this equation out and was the one who first stipulated that the end of the world would be tomorrow um, is the same man who created an equation saying that it would be the end of the world in 1994. I was reading about this. Apparently, he created this whole thing. He started a huge buzz saying that in 19, on this one day, I forget which day, in 1994, um, it would be the end of the world. Turns out 1994 came and went, and <laughs> nothing. A long time ago it went. Um, and so this same man reworked his equation um, and says now that it's going to be tomorrow. Um, I don't believe that. <laughs> no, no. The world has just begun. Goodness, we're starting to figure things out now. All things that were evil and were not good, we're actually starting to work it out now. Human, humans and mankind, to me, is improving. We're on like this huge, vast road of improving and like getting better and. You know, quality of life is getting better around the world. We're like helping other people. Of course, there are there are world problems, but you know, it's getting fixed right now. We are reaping the benefits of the generation before us, and it just continually gets better in everything: medicine, um, technology, uh, you know, social communication. Everything is getting better. You know, there's no way to me God would end the world now at this point. No way. Um, anyway, <laughs> um, so that's my blog for today, and um, uh, so I just I don't believe a bunch of numbers um, can calculate the end of the world. So if you're watching this after May twenty first, um, all I have to say is, told you. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Love ya. Value life. Bye. Oh, that's a good thing about this whole thing. It makes you reflect and value, you know, your life. So take that out of this whole experience. Don't live in fear. Live in love. Bye.